just had a pine cone throwing at us. Uh, there's no pine cones as you can see in any, here we go, I'll use this example. No pine cones in the trees. Anyways, the pine cone was throwing at us. We hear a river off in the distance, but right now we're on the top of one of the mountains. And you can see the foliage is so thick, but you know, there's rocks, there's possible caves. We're looking for footprints. We're very deep in the woods. When we do our Bigfoot expeditions, we don't stick to the trails. We go off, we explore. We don't, there is no set trails, you know. We look for areas that are soft and sandy. We look for anywhere that might reveal a cave, a den. Uh, this is kind of an odd little area. We're trying to go to the top of one of these mountains because if we can get a scenic view, we could find out where else we could explore in the next day or two while we're camping out here. It's not a pretty picture. You know, it's, you got a lot of rocks. There's a lot of climbing. There's creeks, uh, you know, it's, there's thorns. There's, there was a bug that was like three inches long. It landed on Jared. There's ticks and, uh, you know, it's you're constantly climbing up because some of these mountains can go 8, 9, 10, 11,000 feet in this region. So you don't know when you're at 11,000 feet because you'll keep going and going and going to the top. And three hours will pass and you'll realize that you're still not up at the top. But uh, I believe if we continue up for the next half hour, we should reach the top of this ridge and we might get a good view of any rivers or lakes in the region. As far as I'm concerned, we've been hiking for a while. There are no roads, there are no cars, there is no campers, there's nothing. I found earlier some toe impressions. It wasn't a foot impression, but it was like something stepped with their toes downward. There's three, four toes dug in the sand in the middle of nowhere. You gotta believe the work that we do is honest. You know, we're sitting here and we're hiking and we're hiking and we're hiking. There's no set place where we're going. We're just doing what we gotta do to get the evidence. And I see, it's gonna be a hell of a climb, but I see up here way up on top. I have a hell of a climb up here, but it's a peak. And I'll show you. But we're gonna climb it. We gotta make our way all the way up there. Fort National Forest, El Dorado National Forest. We're in the woods, we don't even know where we're going, man. You know? But uh, it's the Laura Rick of the Paranormal Ghost Society. We're in the Coal Creek, Bear River and Reservoir area which is about five miles of reservoir from here, six miles. And the rest is all, I mean, is wilderness for miles on end. So we don't really have a set place we're going. This climb is gonna kill us. This is a steep climb to the top. When we get on top, we should be able to see most of the mountains and hills in the area. And that's when I will take the camera and I will get another scenic video and scenic shots. Along the way, we might find some more tow tracks, stool samples. There might be, there's a lot of rocks. We might find another den or cave. I don't know. But we will continue the expedition and we will head back for lunch and we will do a second expedition before nightfall. And tomorrow, I expect two more expeditions. And then in two weeks, we got, we got another camping expedition. And two weeks later, we got another one. Um, all in different locations, deep in the Sierras, where we will search for America's great ape Sasquatch.